Human Rock, basically too drunk to die. The Payday 2 Stoic Perk deck by the Russian Badger. How much money will we lose if I lit up this whole doctor's office? A lot. You would, you would regret that. Do it. A lot. Do it. No, do it. Do it. Do it. No ball. There's so many. Use the explosive shotgun. So many cleaning costs. <laughs> Don't worry, dude. I won't lean into Stoic too hard two seconds later. <laughs> I'm actually suffering from liver failure from my crippling alcohol addiction. <laughs> Cheers, bro. I'll drink to that. Cheers, bro. I'll drink to that. <laughs> Mr. Gorbachev, I tore down this wall! Amazing. Stoic is by far the dumbest perk deck in Payday 2, and that's really saying something, because Payday 2 alone is already dumb as shit. Don't stack, don't. <laughs> <laughs> but it's the good kind of dumb like the this is stupid but i kind of like it at the same time type honestly that's the best way to play payday in my opinion i think the fact that it's not a hyper realistic fps is in its favor uh there was i was running dragon's breath on uh one of the shows i run uh anarchist anarchist shotguns right now which is absolutely just amazing i become a shark i just like i live to go forward and press fire <laughs> and i and I armor gate. It's great. I'm absolutely loving it. And payday, I think, is best when you have those interactions. It's not hyper realistic. It's not this, you know, hyper immersive kind of thing. It's oh my god, you literally walk a drill with you. You bonk the drill, and you can restart it 50 percent of the time. It's great. I think that game has it absolutely in its favor. Dumb. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> Dose is gone. Not again. I refuse. You can't keep getting He's away with crazy. this. They he do. just jumped <laughs> through the wall. He disappeared. <laughs> Stoicism is the ability to endure pain or hardship without displaying feelings or complaints. But again, since Thanks. this is payday two, it's the ability to endure pain or hardship without displaying feelings or complaint with liquor. Find yeah. that zen place in your mind. <laughs> Sweet liquor eases the pain. Because with Duke's whiskey filled hip flask it doesn't matter how many times you get shot one swig of jack daniels and the pain goes away just a flesh wound i am the liquor ricky <laughs> i realize this makes no sense not only because your character never suffers the ill effects of alcohol like dizziness blurred vision or loss of motor function after pounding that much whiskey but payday 2 logic is second only to skyrim logic what third world country made this drill it's, it's a awful. vault what do we need a drill it's a bigger vault what do we need two, two drills, drills. <laughs> you can't just like stack smaller drills to make the damage damage of a bigger drill. Yes, this you makes can. no sense. This is like shooting yourself with low caliber bullets to build up your resistance to higher calibers. It doesn't make sense. This is some Skyrim, you are over encumbered. You're gonna eat 40 pounds of raw glass. <laughs> oh damn bro, I picked up this basket. Now I weigh 6,000 pounds. Let me eat this basket now. <laughs> the problem. Bro, actually you're in the middle of a fight. This Nordic ax is swinging down towards your face. You hit the pause menu, 80 wheels of cheese. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and if you don't like the hip flask logic, then just buy my gamer stuff shaker instead. It may not have any fucking whiskey in it, but it could because it's now available to bully and threaten you into consuming gamer stuff 24 7 like I did throughout recording this video. I know, I know, this is a sponsorship, but this sponsor is actually tight as fuck, so hear me <laughs> out. They even sponsor Jello, and he can attest to how incredible this shit is. I want to fucking kill myself. Trust me, I drank it all. Red Bull was good until it didn't have enough caffeine. White Monster Boomer Juice was perfect until it gave me split. Headaches. Coffee was Honestly, Red Bull and me do not mix. I had two Red Bulls one day. Time stopped. Well, I had Red Bulls in like a 40 minute succession. Time stopped. I, I didn't like it. I don't want I don't want to go back to whatever higher plane that was. That was awful. It was fantastic until I started shitting my pants yeah. and G Fuel. Well, <laughs> G Fuel has always been trash. It made me feel like Ooh. I overdosed on vitamin gummies. I went dummy <laughs> off of Flintstone gummies. I'm sure you did. <laughs> pop one of these and forget about it. Seriously, here's a scoop of G Fuel filled with ingredients that spike your blood sugar, leading to an inevitable crash. Why the hell is it so damn big? And here's a scoop of gamer subs. Less than a quarter of the size. Some flavors are less than a fifth of the size and it's non-glycemic, so it doesn't touch your blood sugar, making it keto and diabetic friendly. No bullshit, just 100 milligrams of caffeine per scoop with essential vitamins to keep me focused. I Most love this of the marketing. time I go two scoops of watermelon ice because I'm 200 pounds and my body resists caffeine like it resists communism. But it's not a shot of <laughs> adrenaline that makes me want to fight a bear. It's just a light tailwind in my day without feeling jittery or like death is rapidly approaching from a heart attack. If it's good enough for- God, those gauntlets are so hard to make though. I was talking with armorers and they're like, yeah, the ones with fingers are kind of awful to make that's why you see a lot of clamshells and stuff random facts that i know drone operators overseas just the surveillance kind not the predator missile kind <laughs> it's good enough for you shout out to my boy brian yeeting drones into the sky <laughs> 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 <laughs>
only found. Try it yourself with a free sample pack. You will have to pay maybe five or ten bucks for shipping so you don't bankrupt them, but I'm willing to bet you'll love it, and buying anything in the shop with code BADGER gets you 10% off. And if you want my shaker, you better hurry, because there's a limited supply, and I imagine they'll sell out fast. So if you want one, get one, and use code BADGER. This is a threat. Gamer subs. That orphanage was just the beginning. What? Gamer subs. The thirst demolisher. <laughs> but the gamer juice out of the way, let's get back to the liquor. Now that this little disturbance is settled, let's get back to work. Technically, Stoic works by reducing the damage you take by 75%, and this 75 is slowly applied over a 12 second time frame, during which, if you take a sip of whiskey, all that pending damage immediately goes away, like it never happened. Wow, you feel better already. Your life depends on whether or not you take a swig of whiskey or not. That is pretty funny. There is a 10 second cooldown on it, so holding off your slurp until you've taken a beating is critical, but every enemy you kill reduces the cooldown by one second, Wild. meaning murdering yourself back to hell is an option. Don't plan your funeral yet. Uh, I wonder how this would work. I'm using, I don't, can't remember what uh, secondary it is, but I got tombstones on it. Tombstone slugs. Tombstone slugs go hard. There's there's a little bit of a debate between tombstone slugs and dragon's breath because dragon's breath before tombstones came out got really heavily nerfed. If you're wanting that inherent just DOT spread on like overkill and below and even up to mayhem, right? Like, oh God, dragon's breath shotgun rounds go hard because they go through shields so you don't have to worry about you know your i think captain winters are still resistant but those shields are a little bit different so your your ranger shields your standard riot shields right it'll punch right through that just burn the target but it doesn't have that stopping power that immediate damage and uh, i'm just in testing i using my anarchist build i've absolutely run into situations where i get downed by a cloaker because he drop kicks me from you know five feet away and the tombstone slugs because he's poisoned i will trade with that cloaker making your revive on me a lot easier dragon's breath though i was running to an issue because it doesn't quite meet those damage thresholds but it, it, to each their own i wonder how tombstone slugs would really work with this because i mean very high damaging dot and that does count as you know getting those eventual kills like it's 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 very interesting i'm very very much needing to try out stoic uh, it's stoic stoic give me my flask <laughs> you asshole <laughs> nice <laughs> that's a Note that all of your armor is converted into health, so you technically got no Kevlar on, but you are a giant ball of flesh, like yeah. those delicious meat sleds they serve at the best Mexican restaurants. A 30-inch sled for a family sled. combines both nachos sled. You had me at sled. sled. Santa Claus comes straight out of Guadalajara with a <laughs> fucking meal. <laughs> Pulling up out of fucking... Y'all ever been to Juarez? Yeah, I was about to say Juarez. And it makes slaughtering scores of law enforcement through sheer force of liquor even dumber. There's only one weapon that'll do the job. Or rather, two weapons that'll do the job. Akimbo Brothers Grimm 12 gauge shotgun. Grimms are great. I don't know how Duke manages to take a swig of whiskey every 10 seconds when he's holding a shotgun in each hand. But it's the fabled third hand. Don't worry about it. With this much damage, I don't really care. Kneel before the Duke. <laughs> I am still trying to get the hang of this drinking while dual wielding Akimbo shotguns. Ow. <laughs> oh, thanks, Taser. <laughs> That's, that's the only description I have for that pasta. Let's be real. You literally shot a drunken man dual wielding a Kimbo Grimms. Fuck around and find out. You brought You'll be like, yourself. why didn't you just tase the armed assailants? Believe me, I did. We tried that. <laughs> it did not work. You can go dummy on the ammo count. With the stando mags and close by aced, it basically makes you into a walking, wasted anti-aircraft gun with 54 shells ready to lag your frame rate into the single digits. Ooh, yeah. like a bag of bullets. I'm going to kill your frames. I'm just going to murder every single one of your frames. This your is computer is going to explode. This is beautiful. Ow, ow, that hurts. Ow. Oh my god. I got to pair it with that one perk that gives you like 135% like more ammo drops. It's, it's, this is going to be wild. I'm basically a walking anti-aircraft gun. My frames, my frames with these grims. Oh my god. Oh my Fuck god. Please give Fuck me a medic bitch. Even if they notice us. Okay, I <laughs> <laughs> That dude literally disappeared. <laughs>
Tunguska. Human Tunguska. <laughs> for me, you keep shooting your gun and it's actually lagging my game. My frame rate has <laughs> never been lower in this game. Like, never. It's so bad, isn't it? <laughs> Major upside here is that you're sticking it to the liberals. You shouldn't be allowed to buy a fully automatic 12-gauge shotgun with a high-capacity extended magazine. I agree. That's why I bought two, two. fully automatic 12-gauge <laughs> shotguns. To flip my right turn signal while turning left. <laughs> Take that fucking liberal. <laughs> Major downside here is that no matter how many ammo bags you bring, it's never enough. You output so many fucking rounds so quickly, you at least have to run Scavenger Ace for ammo pickup. Otherwise, yeah. every 30 seconds, you'll be saying, Five bullets left. But you can't yeah. make things easier on yourself with the right skills. And now that you know that you're an alcoholic 2K22 Tunguska anti-aircraft gun, it's time to start screaming with high value target. Because any enemy you yell at automatically takes 15% more damage, 50% percent more if further than 10 meters and bonus it. points if you bring along dragon's breath rounds so the enemies can start screaming too let's go i mean honestly dragon's breath even post nerf still go pretty hard i'm i would probably have to play a little differently if i were going into death wish and death sentence a little differently but man they they go so hard a oh, high value target as well i mean dozers you just you just smell it is night and day as somebody that has both played payday without builds in mind that came from just i run whatever sounds good with my wa 2000 1911 that kind of thing right to somebody that's actually like oh darn this anarchist build goes pretty hard oh darn this stoic build looks like this goes pretty ham right let me yell at him let me yell at him there we go it hey, just melts them. I'm doing extra damage to you because I yelled at you, bulldozer. Now die. Yeah, the only thing that's annoying about Dragon's Breath is sometimes they don't burn. They're just kind of crispy and they're not dead yet. And you yeah. got to shoot them again. Yeah. Sorry. I, did, I didn't mean to, Grouse. <laughs> convert him. Convert him. Convert him. Oh. He could have been a soldier for our side. He just would have been a little extra crispy. He still could. He still he's works. A, he's, he's a little done around the edge. <laughs> and any alcoholic anti-aircraft gun screaming at strangers obviously needs an audience, which is where the controller tree comes in. With a combination of hostage taker, partners in crime, joker, and confident, you can convert two enemy SWAT members onto your team that not only give you 30% more health, not only regenerate 4.5% of your health every Wild. five seconds but are tanky as shit and willing to shoot the cops they just betrayed <laughs> I don't know how your character convinces a top tier SWAT member to put his gun down, handcuff himself, then start shooting back at fellow SWAT members, <laughs> yeah. but I'm not complaining. Lock and load. Ew, perfect. Number two. Yeah, I'm going to need you to go ahead and turn around and shoot every one of your buddies in the face, please. Safety's off. And he's on the scene. There he goes. There he goes. This guy's actually body blocking while I'm ripping off an ATM. This is amazing. I love these guys. No. They need to, like, work on their, like, onboarding process because the fact that you can take a cop hostage for two seconds. You said, be like, no, hey man, you should like totally kill your friend. Like, well, <laughs> like, hey, you got it. You can't hey, you argue got with that. that. He said, what? Sign me the fuck up. You son of a bitch. <laughs> I'll buy you two bean burritos if you, if you kill them. Oh, shit. Oh, you gonna make me act up. Over 9,000 saw is a must-have secondary because if there's anybody that I want holding the device that can shred both people and locks in a matter of seconds, it's the guy that's completely shit-faced off a cheap whisk. Is that a fucking I really feel like the I actually tried this. We were doing uh, Brooklyn Bank recently and our, our mod Rev was having the saw. God, he was burning through saw blades super quick. It feels like they really like balanced out the saw a little bit. Because I remember you could clear entire safety deposit boxes and stuff on very little like saw blades, maybe even like what half a wall on one. But it is very expedited the amount of wear and tear at this point in time. There's probably a perk that ends up, you know, diminishing that usage. It's it's night and day. And it's very interesting as well to see Payday as I remember it and have I come back to a couple times and now getting back into Payday and playing it in modernity. It's very, very interesting to just see all of that. Fucking kegger. Yo, I'm just cut <laughs> order all these dudes. Oh my god. Cut through this door. Cut through this door. Badger, cut through this door. Cut this door. Quick, 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 quick. There we go. Oh, there shit. We go. What the fuck? Damn, that was quick. <laughs> I've never seen anybody do that in my life. What a god. <laughs> Taser, he's in the street. <laughs> That I'm medic taking ammo. cut him in half. Come here, buddy. <laughs> Through the shield. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> Especially if you're rating the DOJ, because once the invincible Captain Winter shows up, you're going to want to drunkenly tell him to fuck off with something special. That psycho just killed one of us with a saw. Get your ceiling. Oh my God. I got this. I got this. I got this. Out of the way. Out of the way. Out of the way. Out of the way. I'm falling back. 
I, I am unloading into his back, back so hard. Get the fuck out of here. Poor you came to the wrong department of justice. <laughs> Nolan! Yeah, I'm gonna cut him in half. Y'all are stalling Captain Winter. What is happening? Grouse is Captain Winter spin botting oh right now? What was that? Uh, he refuses to die, banana enthusiast. He just straight up won't die. He's kind of like Thanos, but worse. He works for the Department of Justice. <laughs> Thanos, but a bureaucrat. Oh, 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 oh. Kong, why was that no so guttural? That sounded like <laughs> you anyway, were that was fighting a for your life. <laughs> Which Heister is the best in bed? I mean, Sydney's probably a front runner. If you can have some Bose noise canceling headphones on, I don't know. Jimmy would probably kill you. You get into bed with Jacket. <laughs> I don't think that's supposed to go there. <laughs> Uh, look, I've said this once, and I'll keep saying it. Good jacket mains are just built different. Like, bold of you to assume, even if it's my lobby, that I have any choice in anything I do. Good jacket mains are just on a different plane. They are on a different level entirely. I've seen good jacket mains do some absolutely wild stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Extra style points if you run the Venom mask on Stoic, where instead of showing no emotion, you're showing every possible emotion at once, and Glowing Eyes Wojak is an acceptable alternative for the crippling alcoholism you're currently enduring. What Ugh. the fuck did I make? Did I just turn Venom into a rat? Like, what did I do? Is Venom a juggalo now? Okay, I found it. I found it. Oh, that's drip. This is such drip. Anti Venom? Oh, alcohol Alcoholic anti venom? <laughs> Why are you doing like the eyes emoji? He's <laughs> literally the more I hate it, the more I hate it. Same goes for using the bottle of whiskey as a melee weapon. If you're not smacking cops with a bottle of Jack Daniels when your shotties run dry, you shouldn't be running stoic. Consider it done! Peak stoic is using all of the above with high explosive frag rounds on your shotties because the damage they output is absolute ass, but their ability to bounce everyone around and obliterate cover makes Malaysia look like a picnic. Why did you I was trying out HE rounds and I wasn't sure what they really specialized in like the ragdolls i could see that when i was getting certain hits but man that damage output was really low so that's very fascinating to hear actually resist a police officer why are you police officers i blew up malaysia oh no accuracy no longer required shield user fuck you it's fun you know, he's getting so bad it's rough at damaging he's still alive grouse no it's rough <laughs> It is, uh, the fun bar is maxed out. <laughs> the useful bar is zero. <laughs> Literally yeah, just Dark spin Souls around in circles and fire your oh, rage. Like, no, Even your own can. dudes are going to yeah. survive. I'm just going to. I could see this working in No Mercy. I could absolutely see as somebody who one of my new favorite heists is No Mercy. I've never done it until recently. No Mercy goes hard. Like, God. I mean, you can run through with, you know, Dragon's Breath and do things fairly legitimately. Like, there's. Oh, God. I love running Anarchist. I have infinite ammo as long as I'm getting headshots of the shotties, Dragon's Breath, and or Tombstones. It goes hard. Like, I'm such a stan of it right now, but I will, I'm will. i absolutely being converted to sniper builds and being converted over to Stoic, being converted over to Dodge. I am trying out so many new things, and this, this is truly just a phenomenal game, even nowadays, even with Payday 3 out. I sprint down the hallway, just firing at my feet. Yeah. <laughs> it's C4 correct. I'm more likely to kill a taser by bouncing him into one of your lines of fire like a clay pigeon than yes. actually killing him myself. Yes. Why do I do no damage with it? <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Let's see it. Okay. So okay. you want to get behind it and just... Oh my god, yes! <laughs> Such a fucking disaster. <laughs> I mean, how long can I keep the taser? <laughs> oh my god. I think you've got the hang of stoic now. You're finally understanding that no matter if it's a bookstore, a department store, or jewelry store with enough liquor, confidence, and a firearm, everything is free. I'm glad we pulled this off in such a civilized way. Yeah. Are all of you looking straight yeah. up on... <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, is this a meme? Is this a meme? Nice and quiet. Please tell me this is a meme. Isn't this VR? Oh my god, we were set up! Everything is free. <laughs> they operate off of a bartering system as long as you have a gun. <laughs> Wait, everything is free? <laughs> 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 I mean, this is, I this is worse. This is worse than that. I'm gonna kill you through the magic of friendship and this gun I found. <laughs> <laughs> and once you max out the perk deck, you not only get the massive healing benefits of whiskey we already 
covered, but an extra 50% kickback on your health every time you drink. Believe wow. me when I say that once you get to this point, you'll feel so powerful that physics don't apply to you anymore. Now this is how it's done. Oh, wait, why is Badger just sliding everywhere on my screen? I'm frictionless. <laughs> I don't fuck with that. He's, he's shit. transcended. Oh I'll play that shit. And then I'ma just I'ma just stop. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'ma exit. I'ma exit. I'm ex <laughs> Michael Jackson just like just like just like he just <laughs> turned 360 and walked away. <laughs> and that's it. That's stoic. I'm so done with this video. I'm going to go get blasted off a cheap gin out of this adult civvy cup that you better fucking buy. I swear to God. And guess what? <laughs> if we sell out all of these shakers, they'll probably give me my own flavor. Oh, this is a four game. I uh, can't walk the game apart. In shit sickle supreme. Hadger's cringeberry crush, litigation lemon lime, wet metal, <laughs> marinara fiesta. Excuse me, a solid. Buy some gamer subs. <laughs> oh, this was priceless. This was. This was spice. My God. No, no, not more bulldozer. Oh my God. As we found out, I'm magnetized to those things. So many bulldozers show up. It's wild to consider. God, I just, oh God. Payday 2 is one of those games that like, it just lives rent free on my hard drive. I will give that SSD space at this point. 80 plus gigabytes SSD space because man, it is it is worth it. And it's been great getting back into playing it and streaming it. It's been very, very cool because God, there's just, it's such a world of possibilities. And I feel that like, you know, yeah, people after a while, yeah, Payday 2. But it's also, it's one of those games that you could take a break from, right? Like you can take a break from Payday 2. And then you come back and you go like another 10 infamy, right? Or another like 20 infamy, whatever, right? It's such a cool game and it's, it, it is honestly timeless and it didn't have, you know, that good of a launch. I think a lot of us remember the launch. I don't, I was after the launch, but it didn't have a good launch. And you know, that payday three hasn't had a good launch. I'm hoping payday three turns it around. I would love to see Badger and payday three personally. I would buy that pack. 100% would actually. So no, this was awesome. If this is your first interaction with the Russian Badger, Definitely go check out the Russian Badger. I love his uh, his Payday series. I'm loving all of his videos. And while this is a reprisal, I will only do reprisals on certain select things. I, you know, I'm not going to do everything. But a lot of these were especially from a time when my QA was just god awful. I was putting out like four videos a day, and I want to make sure these give the they're given the time and respect that they deserve. And because Badger and his company just most certainly deserve it. Go check out the Russian Badger and uh, let me know what your favorite build is. Let me know what your favorite build is in the comment section. Is it Stoic, Anarchist, Hacker, very popular one, uh, Ex-President, uh, Copycat, I hear a lot of people are using. Do you still play Payday 2? Did you work on old Payday 2 mods and stuff? I had uh, some people come out to the stream and apparently they were working on some really really big mods about the time i dropped out when safe cracking dropped so it's it's been very interesting just to see how many people still love payday still come to watch payday still come to engage with and play payday content so it's been very interesting been an awesome video definitely go check out badger see you all in the next one